Do you have way too much gold on your hands? Well, today I'll be showing you the best way to spend it and the most expensive items in the game. Starting off with our first item, we need to go to slash join dark throne hub. And here we're going to buy an armor and sword, which are actually really good. First of all, we go to rep shop and we buy the blinding edge of obsidian. So you're going to need rank 10 mysterious dungeon for this. It's 3 million gold. And also the obsidian arch paladin, a million gold. Uh, it's quite easy ranking up mysterious dungeon, you know, and you can just use a rep boost and you'll be done pretty quick. But yeah, it's 4 million gold in total for the obsidian arch paladin and the blinding edge of obsidian. So next we're going to go to slash join garden. And here we're going to go to Darkon's NPC. Click shop. And as you can see, all these items are requiring Darkon's instant noodle. And for one instant noodle, you're going to need 2 million gold. So these armors are crazy expensive. That's like 4 million gold to each of these. So you can buy a ton of cool items here for millions of gold essentially. So yeah. So next we're going to go to Nolgath and we're going to take a quick shortcut here by going to someone's house and through this portal. And basically we're going to go to Nolgath to a shop and you'll see what we have there in a second. So you go through this door here. Well it's not really a door, it's more like a cave and you go to this, through this cave and through this one. Uh, it seems I've forgotten to change my drop UI. It's still the old one. Okay, so you go middle, right, middle, right, uh, right again, and left. I think for the last one you go left again. And yep, I was right. So you click on Nolgath, click on the NPC, shop. And here you have the Blade of Affliction for one and a half million gold. Once again, this requires rank 10 Vampire, but it's a pretty cool sword, which I'll try it now, as you can see. So yeah, 1.5 million gold for this. You can also buy this cloak for like 500,000. So that's 2 million gold in total just from this. And also, there's another shop somewhere near you can get right now. Okay, so I'm just going to quickly leave this room. I don't want to die, so I will use... Chrono Assassin, 5 skill, and time to leave. Okay, that's pretty good. Okay, so the next thing we want to do is go to left, I think, and then right. Because I'm actually actually another shop, it's really cool. Okay, so here we go. We go to Swindle Bilk Shop, and over here you have a ton of uh, Nolgath items like um, Blood Gem of the Archfiend for three seats of swindles and some identify tens and basically all these items right and you can buy them all well most of them with receipt of swindles and how do you get receipt of swindle 300,000 gold so these are all really expensive gold <laughs> items basically you can get all of these for like 900,000 900,000 and this too all these this is like 2 million basically so yeah you should definitely come here if you're farming for Nolgath which I actually put in my Nolgath farming guide for Void High Lord uh, ages ago. Okay, so the next place you want to go is Yalgar9889 in Arctic server. Here you'll always have these two people with these Nolgath pets. So you click on Drudgeon, click on Assistant, and you accept the quest. This can give you a ton of like Nolgath items, which you're going to need for Void High Lord and many other things. So you accept the quest, click on Yalgar, Shop armor shop and you can buy this and you've automatically completed the quest and you just need to turn it in now to see what you get and pretty much you can get a ton of cool items from here and you can spend literally all your gold on this and it will take you a really long way if you're farming like avoid high lord or anything else nolgath related but there's also some other really expensive items you can buy from yolgar like click on shops click on suggestion shop one Click on armor, and here you have the Hashashin armor for 500,000 gold, which is pretty expensive. So you can buy this, and you can also buy, I think it's in the armor shop, the Imperial Plate armor for 200,000 gold, which is actually kind of a cool armor. See? And that's 700,000 gold just from Yolgar's shop, and infinite gold from this pair. You can pretty much buy as much gold 
memorabilia as you want. Okay, next you want to go to slash join underworld. And some of you may already know what I'm about to get here. And that is the platinum medals, I think they're called. Which you can buy a total of 15. And each costs a million gold. So that's literally 15 million gold. But the reason these are so important is... I'll show you now. Okay, here you got the Platinum Paragon Medal. You need this to make Yamino Ronin, which is a really good class, and I recommend you getting it. So, you just need to buy 15 of these, and you've got all the medals you need for Yamino Ronin. So, if you have 15 million, go 15 million gold to spare, you might as well use on this. And the final place we need to go is Slash Join Citadel. And no, I'm not going to the Nolgath area, just Citadel. So, you click on Polish Shop and the Nolgat shaped chocolate. So you need 15 of these to get Void High Lord, which is 30 million gold. So if you're gonna farm Void High, Lord, Void High Lord in the future, you should probably buy all of these as you can. I think you can only have one at a time though. So maybe you can't pre-farm it. So yeah, that's it. And this is 100k gold. I'm not even sure what this is for, but it's expensive, so yeah. So anyways, uh, I hope you liked the video, subscribe to the channel if you did, and click the like button for the algorithm. Thanks for watching.